One team in the country for a reason. You know, I thought they uh, thought they dug down when they needed to. Uh, we had two, y'all know more than I do, two, maybe three opportunities there in the second half where it went to a seven-point game. And uh, the place was, you know, was loud. It was a great atmosphere. South Carolina are better as far as the atmosphere goes. And uh, I think both those possessions, we go three and out. And, uh, and that ended up being the difference in the game. That being said, I thought our guys really competed. Um, we had our issues, don't get me wrong. We didn't protect as well as we needed to protect. We obviously dropped some big balls that uh, came down, came back to haunt us. We've got to be able to run the ball better with our running backs. <coughs> you know, And a lot of that has to do with those guys. Now, they're, they're a group that has a, a bunch of four- and five-year players. And uh, unfortunately, you'd like to go from where we were last year all the way to the top. That's, and that's where we'd love to be. But... There, there's, there's some stepping stones sometimes. And I thought today, you know, their maturity showed. Their maturity showed. Uh, their length got some hands on some balls. I think I, I told you going into the game, I thought their front seven was as good as anybody in our league. Obviously, I hadn't played everybody, but I thought their front was really talented. Uh, we had some issues with them. They're, they're big. They got girth and length. And uh, the linebackers are low. I thought we did some really good things in the secondary. Uh, I don't know. I didn't, I didn't look open that stat book. We threw for 400 yards at least, I know, and there's probably 550 out there to be had. So, um, but again, proud of our guys. Patrick competed. He, he competed. Um, you know, really excited about how he raised his level. You know, he's had two weeks where Monroe, he played so-so last week, not very well, and to bounce back against the number one team in the country. Uh, he ran for 400. I don't know what he rushed for, 75 plus, I would say. Um, I don't know what the sacks and all that stuff, how that ended up. But he did some good things running the football, and uh, we're close. We just gotta, we gotta, uh, we gotta continue to get better. We gotta find a way to get number six. You know. Is this as good as Patrick has played? Yes, yes. That, you know, this is as good as he played. Played really well the first half against UT Martin. Um, you know, he played. And here's the encouraging thing. All right, he played really well at Florida. Okay, and and he played really well today. But you know, he probably said this. He's got a good feel for for how things go most of the time. Um, you know, he was a decision here, decision there from, from having a really big day. And, and the thing that he's got to learn is, and listen, I'm proud of him. This is the best he's played, so I'm, I'm nitpicking here. But um, he's got to take what's easy. You know, take what's easy and, and not try to force the big play. You know, now we, uh, uh, we made some big plays today, you know, and, and I think moving forward we have to do that to move the ball against, against really good teams. What can you do for confidence for this stretch run to come off something that's sort of demoralizing as last week and come yeah. out and have a, have a chance against the number one team in the country? How much did you need that for this stretch run? Yeah, well, I, I don't know if – I don't think our guys – you know, the, the, one of the real positives of being young is they just don't know any better. So it wasn't like they never ever, ever lost confidence. You know, it was, hey, I didn't get the ball or, you know, whatever. Not in a negative way. It's just like they never lost confidence. Um, you know, and we just looked at that and said, hey, that's a really bad matchup. Um, you know, we didn't do a good job coaching, didn't do a good job playing. Let's make the corrections. Let's move on. This was a much better matchup for us. Thought we had our best week of practice all season. Um, that's something that we've got to continue to continue to do. You know, playing hard and practicing well that gives you an opportunity. Doesn't guarantee it, but you got no opportunity if you don't do either of those. Kind of